What is going on everyone? Leon checking in and today we're at it again with another video. So here we are with the Pixel 3 XL, my Android phone. This is what I use if you've been following the channel. And today we're going to talk about how to use the glide swipe method on an Android device because this is going to make typing a lot easier and faster. So we're going to go ahead and throw up a screen recorder in the video here and show you how to do it. So we're going to start things off by pulling down our drop down menu here and click it on the settings gear there. And then we can scroll down here and click on system. Now in systems, we can go ahead and click on languages and input, and then we'll click on the virtual keyboard. Now in the virtual keyboard menu, we're going to have the option for Gboard and Google voice type. And now Gboard is going to be the Android keyboard that we're going to want to put glide or swipe onto. So we're going to click on that. Now in the settings menu here, you can see we have quite a few options. There's something cool I really want to show that people might not know about. You have this option here called theme and we can click on that. You can change the color of your keyboard by clicking on the color there and then clicking apply. And this can easily be changed right away to a different color if you're not happy with it. Now, if you do want to enable swipe or as it's called on the Gboard app, you're going to click on glide type in and you'll have these sliders. You're just going to want to make sure that they're highlighted blue by clicking on them. And now you're ready to use the glide typing feature. So that is pretty much it for this video, very short, but I want to do a quick video on how to enable swipe or as it's called on the Android keyboard glide. And it's just a really cool feature to help make type in one handed a lot easier and faster. Now the problem with swipe or glide as it's called on that Android keyboard is that it does require quite a bit of precision or words will be offered to you that are not the words that you originally wanted. So it's easy to actually have words come up accidentally that you didn't mean to type. So you're gonna to wanna to pay very close attention to this as you're typing your messages or type in your search inquiries or typing up a document. So that is pretty much it for this video today. If you enjoyed it and found it useful, please make sure you leave a like. If you have any questions or comments, as always, drop those below and I'll do my best to answer them. And you can support the channel by hitting that subscribe button. So until next time, Leon, check in out.